Firstly, let us say that this expression is equal to a value x. So let's say x is equal to under root 8, under root 8, under root 8 and so on. Let's say this is equation 1. On squaring equation 1, we will have x square is equal to 8 under root 8 under root 8 under root 8 and so on. Notice that this value is nothing but x here which is uh, equal to same value in equation 1. So we can replace the value here and write it as x square is equal to 8x. On subtracting 8x on both sides, we will have x square minus 8x is equal to 0. Now we have x common in the two terms, so let's take x common. x, x minus 8 is equal to 0. This gives us two possible values for x. Either x is equal to 0 or x minus 8 is equal to 0, which means x is equal to 8 x is equal to 0 cannot be the possible solution here because this value it does not contain a 0 inside the root. Uh, this number 8 is greater than 0 so whatever the value must be there it should be greater than 0. The solution must be greater than 0 so that x is equal to 0 will be eliminated. So the only answer that will satisfy our condition uh, that is a number greater than 0 to be our answer is x is equal to 8. And that is the solution for this expression.